is at nearly 3%. Well, it's just after 10 o'clock and indoor dining should be shut down for the night because of COVID-19. And this is expected to be one of the last nights New Yorkers will actually be allowed to eat inside their favorite restaurants. Mayor de Blasio warns a shutdown looms in the coming weeks as COVID cases rise across the five boroughs. New York One's Ron Lee is in Forest Hills, Queens tonight with the latest. Ron. Dean, even though it was relatively mild tonight and most people were relishing the opportunity to dine outdoors, we were able to find some people who were dining indoors. And they told us with the cold weather on the horizon, they would be very disappointed if the pandemic forced indoor dining to disappear again. With lots of empty tables to his left and to his right, Jared Rollins of Kew Gardens felt very safe dining indoors at Bangkok Cuisine in Forest Hills. But if New York City enters the orange zone within the next couple of weeks, as Mayor de Blasio is predicting, it means indoor dining will no longer be an option when the weather gets really cold. So what would Rollins do? I probably would stay at home. That decision to stay home and cook would leave restaurants that are desperate for business this holiday season without a customer who prefers the convenience of dining in. It's harder to come out just to grab food somewhere that's farther away just to take right back home with you or to pay like a service to come pick it up for you. It's a little bit more difficult whenever you can't come inside to do in-person dining and everything to help build relationships and everything or to come see your favorite hosts or, you know, restaurant owners. Ricky Burrish from Fresh Meadows was feeling nice and toasty indoors here at Narita Japanese Cuisine. Now that it's gotten colder, outdoor dining does not appeal to him. However, he still plans to support his favorite restaurants, even if indoor dining is taken away. Yeah, I used to cook. I don't cook anymore, so I'll just be ordering it in. And I won't like it, but I do it. I don't have much other choice. The manager of one restaurant on this block tells me about 50% of her business comes from takeout, while the other half comes from customers who sit down. And she fears if indoor dining is not allowed, that business will drop dramatically once it gets too cold to be comfortable dining outside. We're in Forest Hills. Ron Lee, New York 1. Dean. All right, Ron, thank you. Big chain stores and local grocery stores are stocking up.